G'day everyone, welcome to me critical analysis of balloons. It's a hot topic. Did you all see that Chinese spy balloon in America? It's not a very stealth way to spy on someone, is it? Yeah, no, yeah, if we saw that in Australia, we'd definitely boomerang it. I wonder what gender it reveals. This lady is like, please don't boomerang or pop our balloons. Would you do that to Google? Bam! I hope military personnel yelled destination popped when they shot it down. There's Joe, he's like, usually I love a good balloon, I'm pro balloon, but this one gave me the shits. I was worried it'd catch on to a house and then it would be like that movie Up. Have you seen that movie Up? It was sad at the start. What were we talking about? Here's a reprobate doing what I call vertical littering, where they throw rubbish into the stratosphere instead of onto the ground. They've got little letters attached which say I'm a shit for brains litter bug. There they go, but hold on, the tree is about to fight back. I wonder how much they spent on all those balloons. Surely at least 30 bucks. <gasps> it's Elsa from the movie Brave. She's like, I can do all the same stuff that animation character can do. Oopsie, curveball incoming. A rogue balloon enters the scene and tangles up the horse. The steed is anti-balloon. He's yelling, there's a predator on me. Get it off, get it off. I'm freaking out. I'm having a moment. This is like swimming at the beach and seaweed touches your body. I'm sorry I'm not brave. I prefer tangled anyway which is ironic because I'm tangled up right now. Is it still there? It's still there! I can feel it! Or is it? I'm just going to create my own truth and believe it's gone away. That's what humans do these days, isn't it? Watch out for the... Turn the camera back, please. Watch out for the rogue Christmas balloon bauble orca smash -o. It's shed its Christmas skin like an exploding snake. Imagine trying to explain this when you get home from work. Yeah, I saw a giant Christmas bauble explode, kind of. What the fuck? There's another one. And it's a fast bauble. Who's lost their baubles? Am I saying bauble too much? But seriously, who's responsible for the roaming baubles? I reckon it's Bazza, the bauble guy, and he's gonna get a stern talking to after this. Cut to a floaty travel method. Hot air balloons are great if you like standing in a flaming basket that's tricky to control. I personally prefer my modes of transport to have a wheel, but that's my personal bias. Crikey, this is very much turning pear-shaped fast. Some would outright say, tits up. I don't think wheel-based transport requires four blokes to catch you as you slam against the ground. Imagine waking up knowing this is your job, getting dragged across an open field because some dickheads find this activity romantic. Ah oh dear, this dumbass hot air balloon is shaped like a penguin. Here's the thesis question, my Padawans. Is the penguin balloon gonna be better at flying than a real penguin? What's your gut feeling? Use the force. Yeah, nah? Nah, yeah. I reckon you know which way this is going. <laughs> Hashtag fly penguin. Wow, and there it is. Not too bad, but pretty dodgy. Anyway, I'm going to end on an inflatable bluey because why not? I love bluey, you love bluey, everyone loves bluey. This is the only balloon I like. And condoms, they've saved me a couple of times. Anyway, everyone, like and subscribe and go to aussiemanshop.com for all your merch. Free shipping for all of Feb. Submit your videos to aussieman.com submit. Bye. Mm -hmm.